But topping our newscast tonight, more trouble for the troubled Fairfax School District. After an emergency meeting tonight, the district's board of trustees unanimously voted to fire district superintendent Regina Green. The abrupt dismissal came just 11 months after Green was hired to restore order in a district torn by strife, famous for raucous board meetings and under investigation by multiple agencies. Green said she was given 24 hours notice of tonight's closed door meeting, but was told not to attend, and she came anyways. She told Jose Gaspar of Telemundo Valle Central that she was not allowed to speak at the board. The board met behind closed doors for about two hours before taking its public five to zero vote. The dismissal is effective immediately. KGET's Christian Galeno reached out to every board member after that meeting. Green said she was not informed about the complaint against her. She said she was never given an evaluation and never given goals. Assistant Superintendent Laura Brown was named interim superintendent. A regular board meeting is set for next Thursday. Green's dismissal is just the latest controversy involving the kindergarten to eighth grade district in southeast Bakersfield. For more than two years, board meetings frequently dissolved into shouting matches. Then last year, the Kern County Grand Jury issued a scathing report blasting the trustees as divided and dysfunctional. A separate audit by the Kern County Superintendent of Schools found the district had inadequate financial safeguards. The audit raised concerns that Board President Palmer Mullen may have misused district property. Those questions are now a part of a district attorney's investigation into possible criminal charges. The district has three elementary schools and one junior high school.